Tadasana is the beginning. And this verse says begin. Right now, if it's raining, if it's sunny, if you're mad, if you're alone, if you're together with others, if you're young, if you're old, if it's another day and you're bored, do it anyway, get on the mat, get on the cushion. Right now is the opportunity for practice. And what about in your daily life? Is there a way we can think about Atta Yoga Anushasanam when we're grocery shopping or with our children out in the world? One of the ways that I think of working with this nowness is to just lightly say, just happening, just happening, just happening. And that gives me that micron of distance. Uh, Everything that happens will stop happening and change. So that's sometimes sad. Your children, you know, I've, I've found being a mom, now a grandmother, that other people's children grow up at a different speed than mine. Minds have seemed to grow up way too fast, and that's what, bittersweet. And so what's happening right now is everything and nothing. And so when I just say right now, right now, right now, I don't spin off into analyzing how I would like it to be different, pushing the moment away, pulling it in and clinging, just what's happening right now. Your child is leaving for college and you're feeling sad. That's just what's happening. That's just so rising in this location that's named with my name. That's what Atta is about. Right now, the pose feels great. If you think any asana feels wonderful, stay five minutes. <laughs> it will change. But in... When the present moment is here, which it always is eternally, I think that's what this verse is talking about. There is no other place but now. There is no, there's no other time but now. There's no other place but here. That's what that verse talks about. 